Hello traders, FS Pepperetta here. Today is Thursday, February 1st, and I'm going to be analyzing the Euro US dollar starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame for the full top down analysis. So, on the Euro dollar monthly, I'm still very bullish on this overall. I mean, I do understand we have been going down, but I still think this is going to end up being an uptrend. I still think it's going to make a five way pattern, which will most likely eventually go up and take out these previous highs. So let's take a look at it on the weekly time frame. Like I said, weekly time frame, we have been going down pretty strong, but I'm still looking at this move as possibly a Kretzen. At this point, it probably is going to take out that low before it actually does end up continuing down. I think this is already a wave three, and this is probably a subdivision of that wave three, like a one, a two, and a wave three of wave three. So let's take it down to the daily time frame. On the daily time frame, we had that interest rate yesterday for the dollar, and it did continue to push this down. This is actually looking to me more like a 1, 2, 3 pattern now. So at this point, I kind of feel like it's going to continue down, probably take out these lows, maybe make a 4 and a 5. And then maybe this will be a 5-wave correction, like a motor wave correction. And then from there, it will continue the uptrend. So taking it down to the 4-hour time frame. We had that interest rate news yesterday, and look what happened. It was actually a very good setup. And if you weren't participating in my live stream yesterday, you definitely probably had a really nice sort on the yo or some of the other dollar pairs because that was a very clear entry to go sort at the news yesterday. Now, we are closing below the 78%. That's a really good sign that we should continue to look for sorts in a downtrend. I expect it's at least going to take out that wave 4 low on the daily like I was just sewing on that daily time frame. So going down to the one hour time frame, one thing you have to notice on the one hour is that we definitely have one, two, three, four, five waves down. Now we can't say for sure that this is now going to make a question to this five waves, but the fact that we have five waves down makes me think that there's a very good possibility that we are going to make a pullback, which would probably at least go up to one of these Fibonacci levels, at least take out the wave four of this previous downtrend, probably make some sort of an ABC question, maybe a flat or a WXY, go right to a Fibonacci retracement level, and then from there continue the downtrend so for me i would definitely primarily be looking for sorts in a downtrend at the end of pullbacks i definitely wouldn't try to go sort now i would have to see a proper abc or a proper pullback to go sort but i am definitely still primarily looking for sorts at least until the higher time frames tell me otherwise i will continue to look for those sorts on these sort of time frames so don't forget to join my free discord channel the link for that is on the screen and in the description thanks and happy trading